We know Max is a werewolf. <laughs> oh. Oh, he didn't like the word werewolf. Maybe werewolf's his safe word or his trigger word or whatever Take word. Your fucking clothes off. Oh, Fuck sh off. shit. Back. Max, what's going on? Shit just got sexy. Take your fucking clothes off, he demands. <laughs> what is going on, YouTube universe? This is our god, Zero. This right here is the quarry. Thank you for taking the time out of your day to join me for another episode. Sit back, relax, it is game time, and we are picking up the action with the cliffhanger that I left it on for you guys to help make a decision. The first decision that I have hung the end of an episode on for the series. I should have probably done it more often, but the question I asked you is should we recklessly plot an escape, or should we, curiously, try to get on the good side of Sheriff Hackett like we have been leading up to this point. Now, through not only YouTube comments, but social media comments as well, you guys have come out and you've given me your opinions, and seriously, when it comes to doing things like this, with other polls on the channel I do and everything else in the mix, you guys always come out in droves to support, and I seriously appreciate every single one of you for doing so. The decision that we're making right now, ladies and gentlemen, not just the decision that had the majority vote, but the decision that I would have made as well, we're going down the curious route. We are going to see if we can stay on Hackett's good side. Some of you said that it would be counterproductive to go for an escape, given the fact that we've gone down the the safer route all the way up till this point and then some of you are just bloodthirsty and want me to escape so I can get myself killed but I think curious is the way we should go okay so let's say we get on his good side what play then? the smart Mention game mimosas every Sunday till he sees the error of his ways yeah I was being rhetorical the dude doesn't have a good side to get on I mean he don't even talk to us half the time I don't know I think we could crack him I think we could crack him as well or I think he's just biding his time until he can figure out a way to get rid of us Permanently. Oh. I think we should try. Gotta I remain optimistic. I mean, if he was gonna kill us, we'd be dead by now. Absolutely so what's correct. He for? Look, we just. If this doesn't work, we try to escape. Deal? Best of both worlds. Yeah. Best of both worlds. Deal. And at the end of the day, trying to get him on our so side presents a good right, opportunity how are we to, to escape. Get this guy to like us if he won't even talk to us. I don't know. I mean, he's got to have a weak spot, like something we can use. It's not like we don't have time to figure it out. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Hey, hey. T-Money. Can I call you T-Money? <laughs> Why? You can call me Officer Hackett. Hackett? Like as in Hackett's quarry? What's it to you? Just interested is all. I'm curious. Feel like we hardly know you. Had us cooped up oh, long enough. Keep it that way. Okay. Oh, come on, T Money. Lighten up, man. T Money. No reason we can't Money. be buds, right? I can think of seven. Understanding or skeptical? Let's be a skeptic. Really? Seven? Failure to comply. Trespassing. Dangerous driving. Breaking and entering. Resisting arrest. Endangering local wildlife. And you keep calling me names. Yeah, but aside from all that... Well, Team money is oh, not an arrestable offense. Look. There's no reason why we can't change things. Why does it all have to be so ugly all the time? Oh. I see what you're doing. Do you? Well, it's not gonna work. You think we're just gonna be besties, and I'm gonna let you walk right out of here. Not that, gonna happen. Asshole! Connor was the plan. Mess. We know what's going on! We know Max is a werewolf! Hmm. Oh! Full moon's in a few days, right? What, what then? 
No, ma'am. You don't know the half of it. Oh, he didn't like the word werewolf. Maybe werewolf's his safe word Say, or his trigger word or whatever take word. Your fucking clothes off. Oh, Fuck sh off. shit. Get back. Max, what's going on? Shit just got sexy. Get the fuck away from him. Take your fucking clothes off, he demands. Come here. Get off of me. Shut up. Have a seat. Quit squirming. Said you want to be a vet, right? Call us an internship. <laughs> Let me go! You're not going to believe it until you see it for yourself. Just fucking ask next time then, dude. Jeez. Don't get too close. T, come in. What's your position? Over. Shit. Who's that, T? Mm-hmm. Just wrapping things up here. Not gonna call for help. Down to 20. Over. What's gonna happen? Well, I'll tell you. It's not gonna be pretty. But don't worry. I'll be back at dawn. You're really gonna leave me here? You'll be fine. Just don't get too close. So you're going to leave me here until dawn? It's okay, Max. I'm here. He's starting to get that look. We've seen that look before. Let's be compassionate. Don't worry, Max. I'm here. Yeah. Yeah, right. Are you alright? I, uh... I don't know. I just don't feel so good. Um... What do you need? What can I do to help? I was just hot. Are you hot? Well, I'm kinda stuck next to this big-ass pipe, so I'm not exactly cool. Just stay back, okay? You shouldn't be this close. There's not a lot I can do about that right now. Just don't bite me, Max, okay? Max? Max? Tell me what's going on! I told you guys how much I fucking love werewolves, I'm just saying. Oh! Well, that's how the bitch lost an eye. How fucked is it? Fuck! Oh yeah. Stitch the hole up. She was supposed to work in the nurse's office, so I suppose that knowledge paid so off. Much for depth perception. Makes you look badass, Laura. Let's see what that bastard cop's hiding. Can we... I 
just wanted to see if we could go see him. And now we try to make our escape, or at least we, uh, we plot something a little bit deeper. Let's, let's go upstairs. I don't think, if anything, right, moving that brick in that room means we're going to have to hide something in there and play possum. So, Fuck. hoping we can maybe find ourselves a, uh, find ourselves a knife or something that we can hide in there. Whoever was wearing this can't be doing too well. A charge, Sheriff's badge. Is there seriously nothing else in here? Come on, come on, come on. I've got a feeling we're on a time limit here, even though we don't physically see one. That is what I'm talking about. This must be what he used to knock me out. I can hide this in my cell. Yes, we can. And we're going to knock the prick out. We're going to put the prick to sleep. Huh. Mama's boy. Fifty-six. That means he was born in... That's some good mathematical skills right there. I need to lie down. Okay. Let's do ourselves a favour and head back to our room then, shall we? If there was only one thing we could grab, we've got the syringe, and that's going to bode very well for us moving forward. Raven? I heard a raven. What's he hiding? That was another wolf. There is definitely more than one fucking wolf. No tarot cards to be found by the looks of things, so... Let's hide our syringe. And let's go to Betty Boys. Time to get some rest. You want to tell me what happened? I could ask you the same thing. Why didn't you run?
I gotta be honest, I didn't want to leave Max. My the, the love of my life. Max. This doesn't mean I trust you. I don't care. I just want to help him. Turn around, hands against the wall. Seriously? I am too tired to argue. But... Ugh. Me too. Happy? Find anything you were looking for? Brew some coffee. I can't wait for you to come back so I can knock you out. Oh, look at fucking Gunter over here with his fucking overalls. What's this? An education. Watch. Day 29. It's been almost a month. Nice job cleaning up. The eye. I mean... It's harder than they make out in the textbooks. Especially when nobody's helping you. You're the doctor. Uh, animal doctor and no I'm not and I probably never will be stuck in here forever you know just cuz you know doesn't mean you know you know yeah cuz that makes a lot of sense uh, you know what I'm not this isn't what it seems to be. You're gonna have to be more specific. You and Max are in just as much trouble as I am. My family? We didn't mean to hurt anybody. We're just trying to survive like everybody else. Do you understand? Not really. What do you mean your family didn't hurt anybody? We're gonna end this thing once and for all. We? Yeah. Let's fucking end it then. Okay. Fine, let's end it. Let Max and I go and we'll find someone who can help. Not what I had in mind. You're seriously asking for my help? I don't want you to help me. You're gonna do this for Max, and I'm gonna get what I need. Hmm. Let's see how smart you really are. What is this? Information. Well, what does it mean? Read it. What does it say, Laura? When full the moon above shines first, the beast internal shall outward burst. One by one leads lambs to slaughter. It stalks your breath, but shuns clear water. And should you yourself be cursed, armed with silver, and the first. Kill the original. Soul before its wane. Rend the beast that cursed you slain. No longer shall you face your blight, or fear the dread of full moon's light. We have to kill the original werewolf. Yep. Keep reading. 
I'm not taking his gun. I am not an idiot. We want him to trust us, right? And if it's right? a bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. Perchance you'll save your cursed soul before infection takes its toll. Starting to get the picture. It's not a lot to go on. And frankly, it's shit. Why did they have to make it rhyme? I don't know. But it's all we have to go on. Kill the werewolf that bit you and you'll be cured. It has to be silver, it has to be full moon. Seems pretty straightforward to me. If you can kill the werewolf, and that's a big if. I just want to cure Max. It's not as straightforward as you think. Hmm. Concerned or confused? Hey, why didn't you kill it? If you knew all this, why didn't you just kill it in the storm shelter when you had the chance? It's not so... I, mean, I, I was... when I... Straightforward? No, yeah, it's so not... You... They're not so easy to hit. I was trying to protect you two. Unless it's a relative that was a werewolf. Let's be encouraging. So what's the plan? That's from hoping you'll come in. <laughs> you Me? don't have a plan, so it's all my doing, is yeah. it? Okay. Because your studies. I haven't even started. Well, you're the best option I got. I've been hunting this damn white wolf under the full moon so long I start to think it doesn't exist, you know? White maybe wolf? it doesn't matter, because maybe there's another way. Whatever you believe, there's got to be some science. And you do science. Look, take some time to think about all this. I'll be back in the morning. Seen enough? Must have shown him video like surveillance footage of him turning into a werewolf? Maybe? I don't think I'd believe a word he just said if I hadn't... If I hadn't seen that. Hmm. I'm still a bit apprehensive. I don't want to believe him, but I don't have a better explanation. I'm just not sure. It's, it just doesn't add up. Hey, who knew we get to star in our very own terrible horror movie? Well, speak for yourself. I think I am pretty well cast. Get well, the syringe. Fuck him. He's had his chance to fix this. We're getting out of here and we're gonna fix it on our own. Hey, Laura? Yeah? I saw what happened. What I did to your eye. Yeah. Is it bad? Well, I don't have a fucking eye anymore, Max. Yeah, it's pretty bad. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry I fucking scratched you and you lost your eye. <sighs> Empathetic it is. It's not your fault, Maximus. It wasn't you. You weren't in control, Max. Know it, wasn't it wasn't you. you. I know. But it was. 
We're gonna fix you, Max. Promise. We're gonna get him spayed so he can't I reproduce. Promise. Chris knew. Bobby told me. Said you scrapped an abandoned car. A while back, I, I worked out the rest. Shit. Why? Well, why'd you think, Chris? Jesus, Travis. You're still here, that's fucked up. I fucking bet one of them, Chris. What's I supposed to do? <laughs> you f yeah. What? It was Chris in the basement. Oh, the plot thickens. You shot me. I'm telling mom. You shot me. I'm telling mom. What's your plan? You can't keep him here forever. I'm handling it. Maybe if you'd done your job, they wouldn't have been at the camp that night. You ever think of that? If I'd have done my job, you'd all be in prison. You ever think of that? That was all Bobby and Caleb. Were those know. hikers? And that 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 fucking. Journalist? Damn it, Travis. What are we gonna do now? Whatever happened to... We're all in this together. I think the Hackett's are cursed. Shh, man. Let's go to my office. We shouldn't talk here. That's why he didn't kill the werewolf, because it was Chris. Max! That's why Chris Max! didn't answer the door, because he was busy being a what werewolf locked in the basement. Travis was just in the hall talking, the cop. So? With Chris Hackett. Was he here to let us out? No. He's the werewolf, Max. Chris Hackett is the one that bit you down on the storm shelter. Holy shit, that's... Who would have guessed? I mean, I guess, thinking about it, I could have... And yet you didn't. It all makes sense. That's why Chris's car was at the lodge that night. Travis was protecting him. That's why he followed us, and that's why he didn't kill the werewolf in the storm shelter, because it was his fucking brother! God, it's so obvious! If, if Chris was the one that bit me, then... Yeah, then we have to kill cure. Chris. That's how we fix you. Jesus, Laura, are we thinking the same thing? It's time. Tomorrow we're getting out of here. I'm gonna get Travis's gun. And kill Chris Hackett. Dum dum dum. Hey, hey, help her! Laura needs help. Uh, Laura, uh, Laura, are you okay? There's gonna be a QTE here. I don't want to fuck it up. Damn it. What the hell's going on? Laura! <laughs> Got him! <laughs> fuck. Yeah, fuck. You just been had, bitch. Cop that tea pain. Take your keys. Take your gun. Now it's off to find your brother. <laughs> Come on, Gunter, let's go. I'm starting to think you were really sick. Well, maybe I should consider acting as my major. <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> we should go before he wakes yeah. up. Sweet dreams. <laughs> Toodaloo. We should grab our staff. We need silver ammo. He must have some around here. Laura. 
What is it? Fucking the hag of Hackett's quarry. I, I heard someone. It's coming from behind that door. They Open it up, Maxie. Let's see what's inside. I heard howling on the other side of that door before, so... There's nobody in here. What the fuck? Got some ammo though. He makes them. What is it? Shotgun shells. He loads them with silver. That's where he was last month hunting. Well, I guess he won't be needing this anymore. Hey. I just realized something. We're free. <sighs> Are we free, though? Because you're still a fucking werewolf. No, Max. We're not free until Chris Hackett is dead. And it doesn't look like we've got much time. I know, you're right, but let's just take the win for now, huh? We'll celebrate when it's over. We're going straight to Hackett's quarry, and we're ending this. Tonight. It's shooting time. Is this where Laura meets up with the group? And I made my way here. To camp. Left Max at the island. Seemed like the best place for him. Surrounded by water and all. That's it. That's the story. Max was the wolf that killed and Emma. Jump in well, kind of killed Emma because we saved her, but... He was the wolf that was Wait, in the treehouse. The island? Like like our island? Like the one in the lake? Yeah, why? Because Jacob, he went back there looking for Emma and he hasn't come back yet. Neither of them has. Oh, shit. Hmm. Honest or reassuring? Let's try to be reassuring. Well, as long as they didn't go poking around where they shouldn't have, they're probably fine. Poking around where he shouldn't have is Jacob's middle name. This is very bad. Oh. After you saw me at the pool, after I shot Chris, um, I went back to the island expecting Max to be back to normal. But you didn't shoot Chris. She thought she shot Chris, which means she thinks there's only one werewolf out there, but there's more than one. We know that for a fact. There, Laura. Max? 
Hello? You're gonna have to pull the trigger, bitch. Laura, you better fucking hoof it. Otherwise, your boyfriend's gonna get more than, more than a mouthful, you know what I'm saying? Well, at least we know Max can't leave the island because he's surrounded by water and the werewolves don't like clear water. So, as long as no one goes to the island, Max is safe. So, Max will at least, provided we kill Chris Hackett, will end up turning back to normal. Um, as for Nick, we don't know which wolf attacked him. Um, so, who knows who we have to kill there, but then the white wolf, this white wolf that, uh, Travis was talking about, is clearly not Chris Hackett, so is the white wolf the, the big one, the one that we have to go kill to ensure that maybe everybody turns back to normal again? That's now telling me that if we have other characters turn, there is hope for them yet, which means we didn't have to cut Dylan's arm off. But it was still glorious that we did, so I'm not regretting that in the slightest. But that's where we're going to end today's episode. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you're new. Playlist in the description if you want to catch up. You guys know what to do. But that's it from me, guys. I'm out of here. And as always, I will catch you guys next time.